Yes, it's a big, interesting week right now, and a lot of people are still talking about the Anis, the DPRs, and everything that is happening around them. But we got some interesting stories to talk about around the music industry. I want you guys to sit back, relax, because it's all about entertainment right now. We're gearing up towards the Grammy Awards come on Sunday night, and a lot of people are expecting the likes of Whiskey to bag a Grammy Awards. What is your own take about Whiskey winning a Grammy Awards? Before we proceed further, I want to use this time out to really appreciate you guys for watching my videos and sharing them across social media platforms. And if you are new here, why don't you take out time, click the subscribe button below, the bell notification I come to always get notification if I upload my videos or each time I upload my videos and guys you can go and check me out on other social media platform subscribe to that follow that like the page and then be a part of our great discussion <music> I want to talk about music right now. I want to talk about the Grammy Awards. What a lot of people are expecting, like uh, you know, Whiskey winning the Grammy Award after being nominated into two categories. And you have to understand that uh, last time or the last Grammy Award, uh, Burner Boy actually came out victorious, and Whiskey won alongside Beyonce, and that was all interesting at the end of the day. Right now, we got a nomination of Whiskey into two categories that is Corsi Essence and uh, right now we say that Whiskey winning a Grammy Awards with Essence that means Thames also won a Grammy Award that is something we are now looking at at a point like this and Whiskey has actually helped out the lives of Thames to express themselves on a global scale and people are saying thank you Whiskey for actually giving Thames an opportunity to express herself and that marked the uh, interesting uh, kind of uh, phase of uh, Thames' career. Right now, I have a song that is coming in from Odubu Burner Boy, and a lot of people are now expecting that. But he shared a kind of uh, uh, snippet of the song on social media, and that is being well appreciated by a lot of musical fans out there saying that Odubu wants to do it again. Let's have a snippet of that song. Last, last, last. Now everybody go to breakfast. Apart from Odogu uh, sharing a snippet of song, I think Odogu is one of the biggest arts in Nigeria alongside the video Whiskey and Bonner Boy. And these guys have been like, you know, the greatest of uh, the decade for a particular time right now. And a lot of people can't talk about music in Nigeria without talking about Odogu, um, Whiskey and Bonner and uh, that video and that is quite interesting to an extent and right now people are saying that are we going to see a reconciliation between uh the video and Bonner boy even whiskey are we going to see them in studio because remember last time the video came out to say uh he has never been in the same uh, space uh, in the studio with uh, whiskey and that was uh, actually a kind of um, you know disappointing to a lot of people expecting a collab soon with uh, between whiskey and david o. and somehow some people are hinting that that could be possible when some people decide to like invest a lot of energy in that. What do you believe about that? David O and Whiskey having a song together because a lot of fans are now praying for that to happen anytime soon. Yes, remember Odogu Barabo actually came out to say, man, he is the highest paid artist in the history of Africa. And a lot of people thought that even music executive uh, fans out there, they said, man, Odogu, you lied. Just, you are talking from your own point of view. Somebody sold out O2 Arena three times and then in less than an hour sold ticket of 60,000 and you just sold half that ticket and you are saying that, man, you be a uh, big enna. You know, that is not it at all. And uh, Whiskey uh, is one big guy that 
always don't show up on social media to an extent whiskey got a private jet according to what he said uh in puerto rico and that got a lot of fans talking on social media do you think uh, you will ever see a reconciliation between the video and whiskey uh, boner boy after watching this uh, interview uh, of David o with Ebuka, let's have a glimpse of that interview so that we get to understand. Bro, it's not me, bro. Now my bro everybody I've helped are keeping me afloat. Yeah. That's why you notice that all these people don't really help people or did bad to people. Going up is sweet, but you're coming down go bad. My own coming down, as I come down, they go to push me back up. But away from that, let's focus on things right here. Davido and Zlatan Ibile are putting out a song and they've shared a snippet of the song and that song is all interesting. But some people are saying that Davido, you have to make yourself available for international platforms and all those kind of things. And I think that is what we should encourage Davido to do right now because it's enough of the local uh, platform. Let him go international, make songs that are more universal. At the end of the day, I think uh, Davido has not focused on universal song for a very long time, ever since uh, the time of Fall Eve and other uh, songs. But Davido should try and focus on making more global sound. That is what. I will encourage the video to do at a point like this. And what is your own take about that? Timaya and Ubi Franklin, they are digging it out and a lot of people are saying that, man, Timaya, <laughs> make you not go beat Ubi Franklin this time around or they said something about themselves and all those kind of things. I think this is a bit childish. Uh, they should find a way to squeeze out of social media. But uh, recent time, I think Ubi Franklin has been sounding so frustrated and he even acknowledged it um, in his uh, one of his posts uh, saying that he is going through a lot and all those kind of things, family stress and different things. And then business-wise, and people decided to call Upi Franklin Nani, you know, ever since uh, being uh, uh, captured with um, baby Ifa and David's uh, baby and uh, son. And uh, a lot of people are saying that, man, that one now your new job right now. That is what is trending on social media. But away from that, let's kind of encourage Whiskey to get in a Grammy Awards because Whiskey is our own and our own is our own. Before I jump off finally, I want to use this time out to really appreciate you guys for watching my videos, sharing them across social media platform, being a part of it is all interesting for me. And if you are new here, why don't you take our time, click the subscribe button below and the bell notification icon.